Uh, the registration process was simple uh, and really fundamentally easy to follow through with. I was able to provide my information and I was able to quickly get in and uh, get ready for the donation. Uh, the new concierge is phenomenal. It's uh, seamless, it's so easy to process. I just do the buttons, hit the card, and you're off to the races. I really wanted to donate because I, I thought I would feel fulfilled being able to help somebody today. But on a personal level, uh, when my son was born, he spent a lot of time in the hospital. Uh, I felt like we utilized a lot there, and it would be nice to be able to give back. The lady at the front desk basically told me to come over here, uh, answer some of the screening questions, and then I'd be heading over to the screening booth afterwards. The opening process was just a bunch of questions, you know, just kind of gathering some of my basic health uh, information, and uh, it was pretty simple. Uh, this is where we screen the donors and check their eligibility to donate, go through all their questions that they've answered either at home or here at the clinic, gauge their height and weight on how much volume we're going to be taking for plasma, and then we check their hematocrit and protein to make sure that they're within a normal healthy range to donate. Hi there. Hi. Hi. You're Ryan? I am. Great. This is your first time donating plasma? It is. Great. Thank you for coming in. Okay. So Check for your veins. Perfect. I'm sure they're good looking veins. <laughs> okay, so I'll just get you to make a fist for me. Fantastic. Fluids, were you talking about water? I'm talking about um, something called anticoagulant to keep your blood from clotting so we can separate your plasma. And also we give you back some saline as well, which is like salt water. Oh, interesting. And is it gonna be one needle or multiple needles? So this is just a one needle process. What is the machine doing? So right now the centrifuge is spinning at 7,000 RPMs. We're, we're separating your red cells from your plasma and collecting it off in the front bag. And in a minute here, we're gonna have a return so you'll get your red cells back through the same needle. Feeling pretty good, Alan, yeah. So no problem seeing it? No, you were right, there's, this isn't bad at all. Okay, so you're actually in your last return, which means you're almost done the procedure. So you're actually getting some saline back right now, mixed in with your red cells, and that keeps you hydrated after your donation. Oh, that's fantastic. So everything's all just, again, happening through the same line. Happening through the same line, absolutely. Oh, that's great. Do you guys reuse this equipment? Nothing's reused. Everything's single disposable use, and we dispose of everything after your, your donation is complete. Oh, that's great to hear. Okay, so this is your first time. We wanna make sure that you're not doing anything strenuous after and you're uh, keeping yourself hydrated and make sure you're not lifting anything heavy with the donation arm. Okay, perfect. All right, Ryan, you're all done. Thank you. I felt really uh, apprehensive at the beginning, um, but as Victoria came and sat down and explained the process to me and helped talk through each of the steps, I felt much uh, better as we progressed all the way through the whole process. I think the, the cool factor was that at the exact moment when all of a sudden I was getting the, uh, the saline and, and blood combination coming back in was definitely a highlight. It definitely felt really neat. It was a really great experience. Uh, it was you know everybody was so welcoming. Uh, they informed me about everything along the way. I feel like you know I, I I have helped somebody today. I have contributed to somebody's wellness, and I think that's a great thing. So special because you're walking in to see people you already know. Um, they're very welcoming. Um, you know the process, so your level of uh, ease and, and excitement at the same time is. is is great. Coming with Alan uh, really kind of helped calm me down. Um, seeing somebody who's been this through this so many times, uh, it really helped me get through this. I think I'm not nervous now uh, because I was able to see everything step by step. There was instructions, it was fantastic, and everybody was so uh, warm and welcoming.